Gerber Baby presents the world's most famous mother and the world's best loved singer, Madame Schumann Hank. The Gerber Company, makers of the famous Gerber strained vegetables and cereal for babies, welcomes you once again to another program featuring the songs and philosophy of Mother Ernestine Schumann Hank. You know, the only way the Gerber Company can continue to bring you these programs is through the increased sale of its products. If you have a baby now on strained vegetables or cereals, we hope you will try Gerber. Now, now we want you to join our party. The members of Madame Schumann Hank's program have just presented her with a birthday cake in honor of her 73rd birthday, which occurs next Thursday. So I'm going to ask her if she won't say a few words on the subject of birthdays. Ach, uh, hey, I don't know what to say. The birthdays, I just ate my good cake, you know, part of it. <laughs> The birthdays are just like taxes. They come around regular and you can't get away from them. And it is funny how people think of birthdays. First, the young boys and girls can't have them fast enough. They say, oh, if I was only 18 or 21, then when they reach those birthdays, they think, now, if I was just 25, then I would be a really grown-up. But then when those girls get to be 30, <laughs> they are sorry their birthdays came so fast. So maybe they keep on having 30th birthdays for the next five years. <laughs> and those funny men, don't you laugh, they say, what should I care about birthdays? But when they are about 45, you should see them before the mirror. Mm -hmm. <laughs> to see whether the belt line is a little dodging <laughs> or if the hair is grayer at the temple. And they, too, would like to give back some of the birthdays they have celebrated. But I, <laughs> I have already almost as many birthdays as Methuselah. Next Thursday brings my 73rd, and I have not skipped any of them. I do not feel like 73, no. I feel very, very young, I must say. I hope I have low more birthdays. And every time one of these wonderful cakes you gave me, I would like to give you all a piece of my birthday cake, but what will be left over? Now, orchestra, beloved, play something, will you? <laughs> Appropriately on her birthday program, Madame Schumann Hank has chosen to sing a number which has always been very closely identified with her. She repeats it on this program by universal request. Brahms Wiegenlied, Cradle Song.
Thank you, Madame Schumannheim. And now, the orchestra plays you a song. A musical birthday present from them to you. It's chansonette. Kapellmeister, and your boys, too. Thousand thanks. You know, when one gets to be 73, you have learned a lot, or you have learned nothing. But maybe sometimes there are more important things than even that. Troubles, I have had, yes. But little tiny things compare it to the happy ones. I have had friends, and that is next to the greatest thing in life. But I have had my babies, too. And that is the greatest thing. There is no mother worthy of the name of mother who would not agree with that. For without children, oh, life would be so empty. With them, it is full and noisy and vast for spectacle, Monte Small. I thank the good Lord that he let me sing, too. And by singing to make somebody else maybe just a little happier. I have sung for crowds, crowned heads, but never am I happier than when I sing for just ordinary folks or for some of my beloved wartime bodies in veterans' hospitals. For I like to think they still love me and call me mother, which they always called me during the war when I sang to them in camps and hospitals. But today, I am happy with my singing for the Gerber people. For on the radio, I can travel to homes all over the land and sing to mothers and fathers and their babies in those homes. And I get letters from those people oh, who maybe can travel to city country or who maybe have to stay sick in bed all the time. And to those folks, I sing right in their own homes. And I am happy because Mother Schumann Hank is their welcome guest. I can think of no more appropriate song just before your 73rd birthday, Madame Schumann Hank, than Stelle Nacht, the song that has endeared you to all the world, a song everyone knows and loves you for.
for everyone who's ever had a home to love and cherish and remember. Now, before we hear again from you, I have a short message to mothers in thousands of homes in the land. Mothers with babies who are about to be given their first solid food, cereal or strained vegetables. A message from Gerber to them. Gerber products, you know, are made only of the finest vegetables or cereals possible to obtain. Ripe red tomatoes from sunny fields, vitamin-packed spinach, golden, healthful carrots, and all the rest processed by the exclusive Gerber way, which retain valuable vitamins to a greater degree than they can be retained by home cooking. They're better for babies, as so many doctors say. And you can get them at your grocery or drugstore. Just look for the blue and white label in the special Gerber display rack and choose the ones which your physician or pediatrician prescribes. Don't delay. Start your baby on Gerber's this week. It'll be so much better for baby, and it will save you so much work on these hot summer days. And now, Mother Schumann Heinz. God bless our happy home everywhere, and the fathers and mothers and babies who make them happy. Until next Sunday, good enough, good enough. This is the National Broadcasting Company. WENR, the voice of service, Chicago.